Good morning, everybody. Um, just finished breakfast, and I'm just about getting geared and ready to go to Victoria. So everything now has been packed. Let's take a look at what's inside. Pardon me. This panty on my right has got all the food and water that I'm ever going to need. Well, for lunch. And on the left, it's all clothing, laptops. Got my extra bottle of water, little toolkit bag. And inside here, all my other valuable items. This is going to be a pretty darn interesting trip. I haven't gone this far ever before, so um, I don't know what to expect. All I can think of right now is, yeah, I'm going to make it. I'm going to do my best. I'm going to get there, and we'll see what happens. So I've successfully made it onto the ferry. My bike's up there. Rode it in. And now off I go. Yeah, I am on the spirit of British Columbia, right at the front of the ship. And we're setting sail for Victoria right now. I just gained 50 meters of elevation. Oh, look at that. Who can beat that? Oh my gosh. Woo! Here I am. Here I am. A little while more and I'll be in downtown Victoria. It's almost there. Almost there. City center, city center coming next. So I made it. I'm here at Ocean Island Inn, in a little hostel. This is my room here. It's a little small little place. Nice thing is that they've got a fan and I've got a window. Those are nice little features. Otherwise, it's a, it's a very small room. Good enough just to stay in. And uh, at least there's a fridge here. Let's see this. That's perfect. If I can store in all my little bits of food here, that'd be awesome. So, here we go. Look at that. All the storage areas up there. I'm gonna use that place properly to keep all my clothing and stuff. Otherwise, just a mini little place. And, uh, yeah, that's it for now. I'll be going out onto the road later on. And going onto the road later on, I'll probably go tour downtown a little bit on my own. Ben's, I remember one of my buddies, Ben's has got this really cool Italian restaurant and he still hasn't sent the restaurant name to me, but I'll ask him for that. And uh, I'll be headed down there tonight. And after burning a thousand cows trying to fight from Sports Bay to here, I think I deserve a pretty good dinner tonight. Alrighty. Well, that's it. Until the next video, signing off. So I've made it here. I'm now waiting in line at Pagliacci's. And apparently there's a lineup and there's a full house tonight. And so this is the restaurant that Ben's recommended to me. Found my way here. It wasn't too hard. A little few twists and turns here and there and I made it in. All good. I'm starving right now so I'm going to go in and see what it's like inside. <laughs> Finally made it to the inside of the restaurant. 
said back in 2007 was absolutely right. Absolutely right. Oh, here we go. There. Alrighty. So, let's see. I'm going to try to sum up a whole day of traveling today. This morning I started out at UBC. 9 a.m. Nah, more like about 8.30 a.m. I left home. Um, arrived at Bridgeport at 9 a.m., 9-ish around there, but couldn't catch the 9.30 bus, so I had to wait for the original schedule. So I was a little ahead of time this morning, but I ended up being on time for the rest of the trip. Um, en route to Victoria, it was mostly all about uh, bus rides and ferry ride. Um, but by the time I hit Swartz Bay, man, that was the best ride I've ever had. 30 straight kilometers, 30 kilometers straight, just biking, plus a 65 meter gain in elevation, crap. Later I went to RunKeeper and checked out the stats, it was, it was mind-blowing. Uh, and then I went down, checked into the inn, the hostel really, and then I had dinner at Pagliacci's, oh, you know what, at the end of that dinner, I said, to the to the waiter my friend Ben's recommended this restaurant to me I have no hesitations recommending this restaurant to anybody else it is so good so so good so if you have a chance to come to my hometown Victoria check out Pagliacci it's, it's really really good and I think I'm just gonna call it a night now it's only 9.08 p.m. on the and it's kind of sunny outside still, but you know, I'm not really in the mood to go for go to the harbor right now. Yeah, I think I'll leave that for tomorrow. So, uh, well, that's all from today, day one of my bike trip to Victoria. All in all, it's been a good day, very relaxing, good time to take my mind off from all of that stressful stuff back in Vancouver. So. Well, that's it. I hope you enjoyed watching today's.